他是真的会修。我真的会修。我要换衣服，除非你想偷看。谁要看呢、啊嗯、？Taiwanese people speak a dialect similar to mainland Chinese because they are part of Chinese descent. So next, please allow us to include recommendation for Taiwanese TV shows or dramas on Top List Drama. Yay! Okay, we will begin with your most common queries. Let us now take a look. Before we dive into our other list, make sure to hit the subscribe button and thumbs up to always keep up with us. Cheers! Before we get married A story about two people who both have a partner and are about to marry. There is just one hit. Wei Wei and Ku Huan are starting to develop feelings for one another. Despite their intention to keep things platonic, Cupid seems to have other plans for them. Will they get cold feet? Will they give in to passion? Or can they keep their feelings for one another in check? 想不到我们会在这种联谊的场合见面。联谊？嗯。你不是跟我说这是什么吃饭的庆功宴吗？还差一点。Lost Romance。Our heroine, Sheng Xiaoen. Works as an editor of romance novels, and she always dreams of having a boyfriend like her Tianxing, the handsome chief executive of the company that occupies the building opposite her company offices. One day, Sheng Xiaoen magically finds herself transported into the pages of a romance novel and comes face to face with her crush, He Tianxing. However, she soon discovers that in this fictional universe, his name is Chi Tu Aoran, and his personality is very different. She hopes to use all the tips and tricks she has learned from the romance novels she has edited to help snare his heart. But she soon discovers that in this fictional world, she isn't the heroic female lead, and instead is an evil side character. Can she flip the story on its head? And end up with the man of her dreams. 总之，这个人我不会用。你现在就给我过来，把他带走。你以为请了水电工就不会遇到我？肯定是没看过我家上个月才出版的《总裁的甜心》水电工。他不只会修马桶，还会换灯泡。你就以为我请不了水电工啊？ Hello again. One hundred days before the university entrance exam, Xiang Keai and Yang Qinghao met a bat in high school. If they are admitted to the same university, she will carry his school bag for an entire year. Unexpectedly, she had to give up her dreams of university to pay off a family debt. Ten years later. They are just across the street, but in two different worlds. Yang Qihao is an executive vice president of George's department store, while Xiang Keai is a street vendor who helps her mother sell clothes at a market. When they meet again, will they remember the bat from ten years ago? Hmm, Xiang Keai, you're doing what? 好好看 Craving you. A pastor chef 
and an internet celebrity singer meet as adults. Both carry scars from their failed first love, but they have learned to live with the residue of their heartache. What will happen when those two men begin to consider love again? And how will an ex-boyfriend's wedding impact their fragile growing connection? Papa and Daddy If you are a fan of BL dramas, Papa and Daddy will be familiar to you as a tale of two guys who marry and have children. However, their family is not like most others, in that their child doesn't have a mother like most children. At first, their happiness as a family feels so natural until the child grows up and wonders, who is his mother? Iron Ladies On the surveys, the three successful professional women in their 30s have everything you could desire love, a career, money, and a family. Look behind the facades and you will see many personal challenges. Fear not, our three protagonists are a band of sisters who will fight for and protect each other. Or will they succumb to societal pressures? In the river. A group of young urbanites search for love and romance, but the unique twist is that their characters have animalistic traits. Our heroine Chu Chi He, who is a goodie to shoes, and our hero Wang Da Shu, who has a personality that is rigid and sturdy like a tree, learn to grow together as they fall in love. Like the show's namesake, Animal behavior is quite representative of human nature. Take the giraffe and the squirrel, for example. They are a metaphor for two very different people who find a way to coexist. Without her, even hero is zero. A story about a devil boss and her nice guy boyfriend as they overcome the obstacles of dating in an attempt to find their happily ever after. Gu Jianyan identifies as part of the Never Marry group, while Su Shuang Shuang is a woman whose fierce and tough reputation precedes her. While they act like sworn enemies at work, they have been dating in secret for some time. Tianan finally gets an opportunity to be up for promotion, but the honor ultimately goes to Shuang Shuang. Moreover, he is about to lose his home all while his girlfriend's judgmental mother looks down on him. With so many problems thrown their way, can Jianan successfully marry Shuang Shuang? <laughs> Brave to Love Sheng Mei, Hua Chu, Hu Shou, Xing Hua, and Song Gang are friends who met in a student association at university. Because of love, they all had a taste of heartbreak. From students to graduates entering society, facing obstacles that revolve around same-sex relationship, workplace bullying, female autonomy, 
extramarital affairs and May December romance, how do they maintain their friendship and resolve all the challenges that arise from life and love? Young Yu Grocery Store. The main lead, Jun Long, has left home to study in Taipei, only to return to be the keeper of the family grocery store after his grandfather has gotten ill. However, he is not just guarding the store, but also the rich emotions and sentiments within it. And Jun Long's memories of growing up are once again reawakened by his return. So there you have it, our recommendation for best Taiwanese marriage drama of all time. Amazing, isn't it? Don't forget to know the title. Bye!